Hi, this is Rainbow Unicorn Cat One. I've told you in several of my videos that Kirsten Larson's coming back this year. American Girl just announced that Kit Carriage is getting her collection back, and some people on social media think it means that Kirsten's not getting released this year. I personally don't believe so. American Girl's given us several hints that Kirsten's definitely coming back this year, and in this video I'm going to talk about them. I'm going to show every single proof we have officially from American Girl. And by the way, if you're new to my channel and interested in all things American Girl but not yet subscribed, please do so. And turn on the notification bell so YouTube will let you know every time I post a new video. I usually post every Wednesday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, but sometimes I post on other days as well. I always post latest American Girl news and leaks. I also post crafts and unboxing. If you're into American Girl, I'm pretty sure you've heard of Kirsten. She was one of the original three characters that Pleasant Company released. They were released in 1986, and each of them had books and a collection of outfits and accessories. The other two original characters were Molly and Samantha, and both Molly and Samantha are available on American Girl website right now. Molly was just brought back last year, but Kirsten was archived in 2010, so she wasn't for sale in almost 13 years. An exception to that is when she was brought back for 35th anniversary. That was in 2021. And now I'm pretty sure she's coming back this year. And I'm going to tell you exactly why I think so. First of all, American Girl really likes to give us hints about new releases. They're kind of like Easter eggs on their social media accounts. Last year on April 22nd, American Girl posted this picture of Molly on their Instagram. It reads, Happy Birthday to our girl Molly. We have a feeling she's got big summer plans. And people went crazy thinking this is a hint that Molly's coming back. I even made a video about it. I was a little bit suspicious, but it turns out Molly did come back. So that post was American Girl's kind of sneak peek. Here's another example. Kit's collection is coming back. On February 22nd, American Girl updated Kit's logo on their website. And then they posted a photo with all the historical dolls with Kit and her original outfit. And then we got official confirmation that Kit's collection is coming back. So whatever hints American Girl posts on social media are not random. They do it on purpose for people like me to look for Easter eggs. Of course they want us to get excited before the character returns. The first time I heard about the Kirsten rumors was right before Molly was re-released. Someone on social media posted that Molly's coming back and Kirsten's next. That person claimed to know someone who works at American Girl. Right now, I don't even remember which social media website it was. It might have been Instagram or Reddit. Anyway, that person was absolutely right about Molly, and I figured she might be right about Kirsten. The first time that American Girl hinted about Kirsten's return is on their TikTok. They posted a video on November 11th, 2022. It's a video about what your favorite historical doll says about you. You can go check it on their TikTok, or you can find three pieces of it in my shorts. Anyway, the dolls that they show are Josefina, Kirsten, and Kit. And Josefina is available on American Girl website. Kit's still available as well. And in the video, she's wearing her original outfit. And we know that her original collection is coming back. So Kirsten's the only one who's not currently available on the website. And I take that as a hint that she is coming back. Hint number two. It happened on February 22nd when the Hoffman twins were released. On American Girl Historical Characters page, we got Kirsten's outline. Look at this one. There's no doubt it's Kirsten. On the bottom, it says in every era, character counts. I heard some people dismiss this. They said, well, it's just a logo. But on the very same day, Kit's logo was changed as well. And we know Kit's collection is coming back. So I'm pretty sure that the Kirsten outline means she's coming back. The next hint is a big one in my opinion. On the same day, February 22nd, we went to American Girl Place NYC. That's when we got the Hoffman twins. We got there a little bit early and we were standing in a line in front of the store. We got to see the displays though, and my mom noticed something right away. Do you see the stand on which Nikki and Isabel stand? That big pink rectangular shape. It has Kirsten's pattern on it. And the only other patterns on display are Josefina's and Mary Ellen's. 
Both Josefina and Mary Ellen are currently available in American Girl stores. So I think this is a very obvious hint that Kirsten's coming back. It's kind of very loud. I think we were the first ones to comment and post on it. We posted a video from the store on the day of the release. Next hint. When we went inside the store, we actually saw many Kirsten dolls for sale. I don't know when exactly they were released again, but I know just a year ago they weren't available for purchase. Right before Be Forever Molly was released, her mini doll was available on the website. So that's another hint that Kirsten's coming back. It's her mini doll. Next hint. On the annual investor presentation, Mattel said they had a big announcement coming out later this year. They talk about a lot of things that'll be released this year, but Kirsten wasn't mentioned. So I take this as this big announcement is gonna be her. There's also a possibility that all the historical characters are going back to their original outfits. Anyway, I think that definitely counts as a hint. And the last hint can be found on American Girl TikTok. They posted it on March 8th, which is International Women's Day according to the United Nations. I'm about to show you this TikTok, but I'll have the sound muted. I don't know who owns the rights to the music they used, and I don't want to get in trouble. And of course you can watch it on American Girl TikTok. I highly recommend their account. It's hilarious. So here's the video. First we see a group of all historical characters currently available, and Kit's in her original outfit. Then we get a slideshow of different historicals. Kit, Rebecca, Courtney, Julie, and look who's this, Kirsten. The slideshow keeps going. We get other characters who aren't historicals, but every single doll in the slide is currently available for purchase. Kirsten's the only one who isn't available for purchase right now. I definitely take it as a hint that she's coming back. I think American Girl's laying it on really thick. They definitely want us to think that Kirsten's coming back, and I'd see no reason why they'd like to lie to us. So let me sum up all the hints we officially got from American Girl. Number one, this TikTok from November 11th. Hint number two, Kirsten's outline on the new historical logo. Hint number three, Kirsten's pattern in American Girl's store display. Hint number four, the Kirsten mini dolls back. Hint number five, the big announcement coming later this year. And hint number six, this TikTok on March 8th. I think that's a lot. Please let me know in the comments if you think that's hinting at Kirsten's return. Also, let me know if you're gonna buy her. I know there are a lot of Kirsten fans in American Girl community, and she's kind of iconic. She was the first character to represent immigrant girls who weren't born in the United States. Anyway, I'd love to hear your thoughts and comments. That's it for today. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please press the like button. And if you enjoy all things American Girl but not yet subscribed, please do so. And turn on the notification bell so YouTube will let you know every time I post a new video. I usually post every Wednesday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Sometimes I post on other dates as well. I always post the latest American Girl news and leaks. I also post crafts and unboxing. Thanks for watching and see you next time!